doctor from the Indian Army. In 1971, India went to war with Pakistan once again. For nine days and nine nights, fighting the enemy without food, without water, with reduced ammunition. But we struck terror into the hearts of the Pakistanis by the use of the Khokri. During the battle for the capture of Silet, towards the end, I stepped on a landmine and my leg got very badly injured. I asked the doctor to go and find something to cut off my leg. He went away and he was away for a very long time. So I asked my batman, where is my cookery? So he said, here it is up. I said, the doctor is taking too long, give it to me. So I cut off my leg and I told him to go out and bury it. After that, I was evacuated to a number of Indian hospitals, military hospitals, finally reaching Pune at the Artificial Limb Center. I got my leg and I started walking, I started running, I started doing my exercises, I started climbing. And unfortunate part is, at that time, the army rule was that people who lose a limb in battle or otherwise cannot command troops. And I was told that henceforward, I would only be a staff officer. That means I'd be doing a Babu's job. So I said, what is your problem? I am as good as anybody with two legs, or even better than them. So they said, you have to prove it. And so I started training. And I did the battle physical efficiency test, leaving seven officers with two legs behind me. I climbed 4,800 feet. And the vice chief, who was, I was a staff officer too, came down in a helicopter and he said, how did you come here? So I said, I climbed. He said, you can climb. I said, sir, there are many things that we can do which our senior officers don't understand. He asked for my file and he said, yes, give him a battalion and all other war wounded officers who are not taking shelter of their wounds. General Ian Cardozo opened the doors for other disabled officers to become army commanders. We celebrate the triumph of the human spirit by saluting him as Dr. Batra's Positive Health Hero 2018.